my name is Elise. My name is Victoria. I'm from the U.S., but I went to high school in Morocco, um, and my family currently lives in France. I lived in Brazil for 10 years, but now I live in Seattle with my family. I, I study, study international, international studies. studies. It's Joseph Corbell School of International Studies. It's kind of in the middle of campus, like right in the center, the library over there. Um, that's the Corbell School. The hospitality building, a couple of dorms over there, so it's pretty centrally located. I would say challenging, engaging, and interesting. We have to take two years of a foreign language and it's required to study abroad. Um, I would say the view of the mountains. There's a great view of campus. It's like right there up in that tower. You can see probably my favorite view on campus of the mountains. And um, yeah, it's just really beautiful. One of my favorite spots to study at. I specialize in development. Uh, my specialization is human rights and global health. Um, my dad is in the foreign service, so um, I guess growing up in that kind of lifestyle um, sparked my interest a while ago, and so that's, what I guess, who inspired me. No, I am the first one. My dad is an engineer and my mom's a nurse. That's kind of a hard question right now. I'm in the process of applying, but something in the nonprofit or um, NGO think tank realm of things, anything goes right now. I would like something in the nonprofit section, maybe Bill and Melinda Gates or something like that. I'm taking 17. 44 credits. During my study abroad, I actually did two internships. Um, one was in a micro microfinance institution in Moro, Senegal, and another was at a traditional medicine hospital in Dakar. I'm currently filming this um, from right outside of the Corbell building um, because I am living in my apartment on campus, so it was a short walk here. I would say international politics. Coding, it was horrible. I took an interterm to the Balkans, a uh, two week interterm. It was awesome, the best class I've ever taken. I got to meet a lot of people in my major that were older than me, so they were more experienced and had a lot of good insight to tell me. Technology and development. I loved learning about how emerging technologies can influence and help, like aid development practices around the world. Keith Gehring. because he's very passionate about what he's teaching and I feel like he cares about every individual student. Technology and development, international futures, and migration and development, for sure. Um, Kevin Archer, Keith Gary, and Tom Rowe. Um, the advisors. All of them have been so helpful in planning and um, understanding what's needed for this major and where opportunities for success are, so definitely take advantage of the resources that they can give you. The academic advisors uh, are very supportive and are there to guide you in whatever way they can and answer all the questions you have, even if it's our questions that are maybe going to happen in 
three years. Definitely getting outside. If I'm ever stressed out, I know just taking a walk and seeing the beautiful views of campus and the mountains nearby will definitely help. I haven't started it yet, but I think it's gonna be, it's gonna fit well with me. I wish that there were more country specific classes. The fact that if I just get out of bed, I will see my friends, the sun, and learn more about things that interest me. I haven't exactly worked on this one per se, but um, I, in one of my classes we use the um, technology international program International Futures, which is a modeling technology that DU is developing, developing and I know that there's a class that I mentioned earlier that you can take about that, really cool, useful skills that I would definitely be interested in. Yes, we have the student-run uh, student cafe, Beams. It's great in the morning or while you're cramming your finals. We have um, the second location on campus in the Corbell building. Um, yeah, they have great coffee, tea, breast, breakfast pastries. Yeah, everything's great. That it's only about politics or foreign policy. Um, we have Condoleezza Rice, the former Secretary of State, and Cindy Corville graduated from Corbell. My major is the best because we get to learn about other countries and other nations, and it's ever-changing, so there's always something new to learn about. Um, the academic advisors and the library. I'm not in any clubs. Uh, in Corbell. Well, I tried to get in the building one day and I didn't notice that the doors were locked. So I just tried to open it for the longest time and a lot of people started looking at me like, why is she that crazy? Probably psychology. Business majors? I don't know. Well, I know it may feel overwhelming at times, but it, it's for sure worth it if it's something you're passionate about. Uh, my favorite memory would be, I don't know if this is a memory, but just being challenged every day by people about things that are happening all over the world. It's really inspiring. 